Gizmo!
feel the rhythm. Mary murderesses of the Cook County Jail in their rendition of The Cell Doc Tank.
people have these little habits that get you down. Like Ernie. Ernie likes chew gum. No, not chew. Pop. So I came home this one day and I'm really irritated and I'm looking for a little bit of sympathy. And there's Bernie lying on the couch, drinking a beer and chewing. No, not chewing. Popping. So I said to him, I said, you pop that gum one more time. And he did. So I took the shotgun off the wall and I fired two warning shots into his head. He had it coming. I met Ezekiel Young from Salt Lake City about two years ago, and he told me he was single, and we hit it off right away. So we started living together. He'd go to work, he'd come home, I'd fix him a drink, we'd have dinner, and then I found out. Single, he told me. Single my ass. Not only was he married, oh no, he had six wives. One of those Mormons, you know? So that night when he came home from work, fixed him his drink, as usual. You know, some guys just can't hold their arsenic. He had it coming, opposite. He had it coming, this world that she took the power in it. No, I'm standing in the kitchen, carving up the chicken for dinner, minding my own business. In storms my husband Wilbur in a jealous rage. You've been screwing the milkman, he says. He was crazy, and he kept on screaming, you've been screwing the milkman. And then he ran into my knife. He ran into my knife ten times. If you have been there... Yeah, but did you do it? Uh uh. Not guilty. My sister Veronica and I had this double act, and my husband Charlie traveled around with us. Now, for the last number in our act, we did these 20 acrobatic tricks in a row. One, two, three, four, five, split, spread eagles, backflips, flip flops, one right after the other. So this one night before the show, we're down at the Hotel Cicero, the three of us boozing, having a few laughs, and we ran out of ice, so I go out to get some. I come back. Open the door, and there's Veronica and Charlie doing number 17, the spread eagle. Well, I was in such a state of shock, I completely blacked out, I can't remember a thing. It wasn't until later, when I was washing the blood off my hands, I even knew they were dead. They had it coming! Dal Lipschitz more than I could possibly say. He was a real artistic guy, sensitive, a painter. But he was always trying to find himself. He'd go out every night looking for himself, and on the way, he found Ruth, Gladys, Rosemary, and Irvings. I guess you could say we broke up because of artistic differences. He saw himself as alive, and I saw him dead.
time. Number 17, the spread eagle. Pop. Number 16, the spread eagle. Yes, I'm here to testify. No, I gotta speak on my behalf. You don't even know what happened. Can I just tell you what happened? He had it coming. He had it coming. He only had himself to blame. He killed it coming. If you'd have seen it, I think that you would have done the same. I mean, imagine why was he hitting this?
this woman, why was she taking that? Now picture her fighting back, think of the ass kicking, think of his ass clipping down the stairs and me at the top smiling, he should have stopped whining. Now could you picture me trying to finish him off? See why I pictured me on this side of the law? High heels leave holes, you'd have thought I was gunning, now the cops coming, I ain't running. He had it. Girl, you should have seen it, should have bobbed and weaved it, before the cops came, got a couple of clean hits. In word, the Jesus couldn't take the abuse, but I Explain that to the state troops But you know, girl, yeah, you go, girl Plus, I look real cute in orange jumpsuits This is the story I'm telling And I ain't changing nothing I just needed you to know, your honor He had it coming He had it coming He only had himself to blame He killed it If you have seen it I think that you would have done the same He had it coming He had it coming He only had himself to blame He killed it If you have seen it Over with. Take the mugshot, heavy up the fingerprint, cut the blood clot. Little Kim, aka Sophia Luciani. Keep your jumpsuit, I'm blocking the money. Yeah, I busted at him once, but that was just a warning. My lawyer be here with bail money in the morning. I'm not guilty, just trying to protect mine. It ain't my fault he ran into my knife 20 times. Just my luck, the bastard ain't die. What you would've did if every other day he blacked your eye? Broke your nose till it started bleeding. Kick you in your ribs, choke you till you stop breathing. That I'm sick of bobbing and weaving He's threatening to kill me when I threaten to leave him I do a bid, cause ain't no way Going to do me like I did OJ He had it coming He only had himself to blame If you'd have seen it I think that you would have done the same He had it coming He only had himself to blame If you'd have seen it I think that you would have done the same Abuse. How many of you been in my shoes before? Oh, have you felt you caught the worst case putting up with his tired ass in the first place? Why am I flipping? I just bought them condoms. I ain't used not one, but there was two missing. Hit a new mission, how to catch a cheater. If he only used coke, you shouldn't smell weaver. If you know he don't smoke, you shouldn't smell weaver. If you catch him cheating, you shouldn't yell. He the one up on him quietly, choke him out silently. He might sound cruel, but you got a lot of irony. So explain that. Just came back off a trip and I come home to this? Please, he didn't follow the guidelines. So forgive me, your honor, but he ran into my knife five times. He only had himself to blame. If you'd have seen it, I think that you would have done the same. He had it coming. He only had himself to blame. If you'd have seen it, I think that you would have done the same. He had it coming. If you'd have seen it, I think that you would have done the same. He had it coming. Where I am Something that 
It's a cold and crazy world that's raging outside. But baby, me and all my girls are bringing on the fire. Show a little leg, gotta shimmy your chest. It's a life, it's a staff, it's a need, it's a blessing. Oh, uh... 
drugs, give a little work, what up on the table, we'll be dancing. Yeah. Okay, girls, let's show them how it's done. It ain't over till we say, and we've only just begun. Let me hear you say, yeah.
hidden paw For he's the master criminal Who can defy the law He's the babblement of Scotland Yard The flying squad's despair Reach the scene of crime, but cavities not there. The cavity, the cavity, there's no one like the cavity. He's broken every human law. Breaks the law of gravity His powers of levitation Would make a fake you stare But when they reach the scene of crime McCavity's not there McCavity's a ginger cat He's very tall and thin You would know him if you saw him For his eyes are sunken in his brow is deeply lined with thought His head is highly domed His coat is dusty from neglect His whiskers are uncombed He sways his head from side to side With movements like a snake And when you think he's half asleep He's always wide awake Macavity, macavity There's no one for he's a fiend in feline shape A monster of depravity You may meet him in a by street You may see him in a square But when a crime's discovered then Macavity's not there He's outwardly respectable I know, he cheats And his footprints are not found in any files of Scott's and Yards. And when the light is looted and the jewel case is rifled, oh, and the milk is missing, or another pig's been stifled, or the greenhouse glass is broken. And the trellis past repair There's the wonder of the thing The cavities not there The deed took place McCavity wasn't there And they say that all the cats Whose wicked deeds are widely known I might mention Mungo Jerry Rumpelteaser Griddlebone And nothing more than agents For the cat who all the time Just controls the operations The Napoleon of crime <laughs> Crimes discovered the McCavity. Crimes discovered then. The cavities not there.
The Battle of Yorktown 1781 Monsieur Hamilton Monsieur Lafayette In command where you belong Are you saying no sweater? We're finally on the field, we've had quite a run Immigrants, we get the job done So what happens if we win? I go back to France, I bring freedom to my people if I'm given the chance We'll be with you when you do Go, lead your man I'll see you on the other side Till we meet again, we go I am not thrown away my shot Hey yo, I'm just like my country I'm young, scrappy and hungry And I'm not thrown away my shot I am not thrown away my shot Till the world turns upside down Till the world turns upside down I imagine death so much it feels more like a memory This is where it gets me On my feet, the enemy ahead of me If this is the end of me, at least I have a friend with me Weapon in my hand, a command of my men with me Then I remember my allies is expecting me Not only that, my allies is expecting We gotta go, gotta get the job done Gotta start a new nation, gotta meet my son Take the bullets out your gun, the bullets out your gun We move undercover and we move as one Through the night we have one shot to live another day We cannot let a straight gun shot give us away We will fight up close, seize the moment to stay in it It's either that or meet the business end of a bayonet The code word is no shampoo, dig me No shampoo, you have your orders now, go man go so the American experiment begins With my friends all scattered to the winds Lawrence is in South Carolina Reads are fine and bravery We'll never be free until we end slavery When we finally drive the British away Lafayette is there waiting in Chesapeake Bay How did we know that this plan would work? We had a spy on the inside, that's right Hercules Mulligan I tell a spy on the British government I take the measurements, information, and then I smuggle it what? To my brother's revolutionary covenant I'm under with the sons of liberty and I am loving it See, that's what happens when you will forget the ruffians We in the shit now, somebody's gotta shovel it Hercules Mulligan I need no introduction when you knock me down I get the fuck back up again <laughs> young man in a red coat stands on a parapet. We lower our guns as he frantically waves their white handkerchief. And just like that it's over, we tend to our wounded, we count our dead. Black and white soldiers wonder alike if this really means freedom. Not yet. We negotiate the terms of surrender. I see George Washington smile. We escort their men out of your town. They stagger home single file Tens of thousands of people flood the streets There are screams and church bells ringing And as our fallen foes retreat They hear the drinking song they're singing The world turned upside down Ah, Mr. Secretary. Mr. Burr, sir. And did you hear the news about good old General Mercer? No. You know Claremont Street? Yeah. They renamed it after him. The Mercer Legacy is secure. Sure. And all he had to do was die. Yeah, that's a lot less work. We ought to give it a try. Huh. Now how you gonna get your debt plan through? I guess I'm gonna finally have to listen to you. Really? Talk less. Smile more. <laughs> Do whatever it takes to get my plan on the Congress floor. And Madison and Jefferson are merciless. Well, hate the sin, love the sinner. Hamilton. I'm sorry, Burr, I gotta go. But decisions are happening over dinner. Two Virginians and an immigrant walk into a room diametrically opposed foes. 
They emerged with a compromise, having open doors that were previously closed. Bros. The immigrant emerges with unprecedented financial power, a system it can shape however he wants. The Virginians emerge with the nation's capital. And here's the pièce de résistance. No one else was in the room where it happened. The room where it happened. The room where it happened. No one else was in the room where it happened. The room where it happened. The room where it happened. No one really knows how the game is played. The art of the trade, how the sausage gets made. We just assume that it happens. But no one else is in the room where it happens. Alexander was on Washington's doorstep one day in distress and disarray. Thomas claims Alexander said, I'd nowhere else to turn. And basically begged me to join the fray. Thomas claims I approached Madison and said, I know you hate him, but let's hear what he has to say. Thomas claims Well, I arranged the meeting. I arranged the menu, the venue, the seating. But no one else was in the room where it happened. The room where it happened. The room where it happened. No one else was in the room where it happened. The room Really knows how the parties get yes. Pieces that are sacrificed in every game of chess. We just assume that it happens. But no one else is in the room where it happens. Meanwhile, Madison is grappling with the fact that not every issue can be settled by committee. Meanwhile, Congress is fighting over where to put the capital. <laughs> It isn't pretty. Then Jefferson approaches with the dinner and invite, and Madison responds with Virginian insight. Maybe we can solve one problem with another and win the victory for the Southerners. In other words, ho, ho. a quid pro quo. I suppose. Wouldn't you like to work a little closer to home? Actually, I would. Well, I propose the Potomac, and you'll provide him his vote. Well, we'll see how it goes. Let's go. No. What else was in the room? Where it happened? No one else has in the room where it happened. Alexander Hamilton. What did they say to you to get you to sell New York City down the river? Alexander Hamilton. Did Washington know about the dinner? Was the presidential pressure to deliver? Alexander Hamilton. Or did you know even then it doesn't matter where you put the U.S. capital? Cause we all have the banks. We're in the same spot. You got more than you gave. And I wanted what I got. When you got skin in the game, you stay in the game. But you don't get a win unless you play in the game Oh, you get love for it, you get hate for it You get nothing if you wait for it, wait for it, wait God help and forgive me I wanna build something that's gonna outlive me What do you want, girl? What do you want, girl? What do you stand for nothing, girl? What do you fall for? I, I wanna be in the room where it happens The room where it happens I Wanna be in the room where it happens, the room where it happens. I wanna be in the room where it happens. I wanna be in the room where it happens. Saying what they trade away. We dream of a brand new start. But we dream in the dark for the most part. Dark as a tomb where it happens. I've got to be in the room where it happens. I've got to be where it happens. I've got to be in the room where it happens. I gotta be, I gotta be where it happens. In the room where it happens. Click, boom. Mr. President, you asked to see me. I know you're busy. What do you need, sir? Sir? I want to give you a word of warning. Sir, I don't know what you heard, but whatever it is, Jefferson started it. Thomas Jefferson resigned this morning. You're kidding. I need a favor. Whatever you say, sir, Jefferson will pay for this behavior. Talk less. I'll use the press, I'll write under a pseudonym You'll see what I can do to him 
I need you to draft an address Yes, he resigned, you can finally speak your mind No, he's stepping down so he can run for president ha! Good luck defeating you, sir I'm stepping down, I'm not running for president I'm sorry, what? One last time Relax, have a drink with me One last time Let's take a break tonight And then we'll teach him how to say goodbye To say goodbye You and I To talk about neutrality Sir. With Britain and France on the verge of war Is this the best I time? I want to warn against partisan fighting what? Pick up a pen, start writing I want to talk about what I have learned The hard-won wisdom I have earned As far as the people are concerned You have to serve You could continue to serve no. One last time The people will hear from me One last time and if we get this right, we're gonna teach them how to say goodbye. You and I. Mr. President, they will say you're weak. No, they will see we're strong. Your position is so unique. So I'll use it to move them along. Why do you have to say goodbye? If I say goodbye, the nation learns to move on. It outlives me when I'm gone Like the scripture says Everyone shall sit under their own vine and fig tree And no one shall make them afraid They'll be safe in the nation we've made I want to sit under my own vine and fig tree A moment alone in the shade this nation we've made One last time One last time Though in reviewing the incidents of my administration I am unconscious of intentional error I am nevertheless too sensible of my defects Not to think it probable that I may have committed many errors I shall also carry with me the hope that my country will view them with indulgence and that after 45 years of my life dedicated to its service with an upright zeal, the faults of incompetent abilities will be consigned to oblivion as I myself will soon be to the mansions of rest. I anticipate with pleasing expectation that retreat in which I promised myself to realize the sweet enjoyment of partaking in the midst of my fellow citizens. The benign influence of a good laws of a free government, the ever favorite object of my heart, and the happy reward as I trust of our mutual care, labors and dangers. One last time George Washington's going home we'll Teach him how to say goodbye George Washington's going home don't have much money, but boy, if I did, I'd buy a big house where we both could live. If I was a sculptor, but then again, no, or a man who makes potions in a Traveling show, oh, I, I know it's not much, 
but it's the best I can do. And this one's for you And you can tell everybody This is your song It may be quite simple But now that it's done I hope you don't mind I hope you don't mind That I put down in words How wonderful life while you're in the world How wonderful life is While you're in the world So excuse me for getting But these things I do You see I've forgotten If they're green or they're blue Anyway, the thing is What I really mean Yours are the sweetest eyes That I've ever seen You can tell everybody This is your song It may be quite simple But now that it's done I hope you don't mind, I hope you don't mind That I put down in words How wonderful life is While you're in the world I hope you don't mind, I hope you don't mind That I put down in words How wonderful life is How wonderful Test thing, the greatest thing you'll ever learn, you'll ever learn is just to love and be loved in return. Oh, 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 oh,
بار بعد رومنس روما روما مگا گا اولالا وانت یار بعد رومن I want your ugly, I want your disease I want your everything, as long as it's free I want your love, mm-hmm. love, love, love I want your love, mm-hmm. love, love, love I want your drama, the touch of your hand I want your leather studded kiss in the sand Quiero tu amor mm-hmm. Amor, amor, amor Maldito amor mm-hmm. Love, love, love You know that I want you And you know that I need you I want it bad You're bad And me could write a bad romance Oh, I want your love and now your love is revenge You and me could write a bad romance Oh, caught in a bad romance Is 
Είναι ο Αντώνης Ρόιτερ που λέγεις 